everyone, my name, as always, is Chaos in the Sky, and welcome to Digimon World 4. I bet there are many of you watching this right now, if you've been a fan of my channel for a while, who are thinking, Chaos, you played this game before, and you quit before the final boss because you said it was a terrible game. Yes! Yes, I did. But I'm back regardless, because this time I have three other people to suffer along with me. Uh, because this is actually going to be a four-player playthrough. So first of all, I am joined by the RTK. What's happening, brother? Yo, got my Ampharos. Oh, no. oh no, it's playing the cutscene again. How do I stop it? Oh no! <laughs> I thought I did that. <laughs> uh, the, the next person who's already spoken out of turn is Liam. Hi, Liam. Hello. Sorry, I was hydrating. Uh, and then lastly, we have Shroom Raver. If this is a terrible game, what on earth makes you think that inviting us is going to make it better? Uh, nothing will make it better, but it'll make it funnier, and that's good <laughs> for my viewership. Foul <laughs> play. It's, it's for the content, brother. Uh, are we all at the thing that says game start and option? Yes. yes. Game, yes. game start to. All right, chat. So, first of all, if anyone actually asks, we're playing this on a legit GameCube. We're all on the same couch. But Please don't tell also, Nintendo. Yeah, don't tell Nintendo. But also, we're using the Dolphin emulator, except not really. And we're using Netplay, so we had to do some input buffer stuff that hopefully won't be an issue. And we've also had trouble where we've gotten desynced, and it's made it where some people can't play the game, namely the British. So we have to, if ever occasionally, we say like, hey, are you looking at the same screen as me? We're saying that to make sure that the game hasn't desynced and therefore become unplayable. But I'm going to I'm gonna hit game start. We're going to get in here and uh, choose our Digimon and get going. Also, for the sake of many laws, we are not on the same couch. We're all on different couches, at least. But five in feet the apart. same room with the same GameCube. Obviously. Uh, really quickly, just to make sure that we're all on the same page. Liam is Liam, obviously. Uh, Shroom could be called Shroom or Dave, depending on the situation. So if you ever hear us say Dave or Shroom, that's the same person. And then RTK is we only call him by RTK, I believe. And then everyone should just call me Chaos. You shall not speak my real name. Yeah. But we also, as you can see, we all, uh, yeah, I guess we are going to go with, like, naming ourselves, uh, okay, fine. I always just Why, name what, myself, what I always name myself Doramon because I hate nicknaming Digimon, but I'll, I'll Wait, does it, it actually, will they, will they call, will they, will they call you Chaos? Will they not call I, you Doramon I, I anymore? I think so, game? yeah. Well, you can Digivolve into other Digimon. Oh, right. So, like, you can sense. actually, the Digivolution in this game is really weird. You have to work really hard to get, like, an ultimate or a mega, and there are no champions. And, uh, you can actually, all of these Digimon can Digivolve into each other. So, like, oh. Doramon can Digivolve into Agumon, Agumon to Geomon, Geomon to Vimon. I might have the loop wrong, but they can do that. Because the way you get certain Digivolutions is by being a certain Digimon. Like, Vimon can get a certain one, and Doramon can get a certain one, and so on. Um, okay. And then there are some Digivolutions, like Beelzemon and Gallopmon Crimson Mode, that you can only get by playing the game three times by NG+. Oh, Plus. yeah. Yeah, that's true. I know that. Yes. But anyways, Ed, in case you aren't actually looking at the screen, I, Chaos, am Doramon. We all decided to choose a different Digimon because that makes the most sense. Shroom is Agumon because it's the only Digimon he knows other than Deputymon and Gatsumon. RTK is I Geo know the werewolf thing. <laughs> <laughs> RTK is Geomon because I believe Geomon is your favorite Digimon? Uh, well, Beelzemon is my favorite, uh, but That's fair. Geomon's my favorite rookie i think that's totally fair geomon geomon to gallopmon is my second favorite line and then liam is Vimon by default yep pretty much all right, i'm Vimon. everyone's everyone, favorite really quickly because we had a d again off screen we had a dc with this everyone's screen says to log into the digital world please wait mine says yep. press start correct yep yeah. yeah. all right let's load and hope that it doesn't desync heck yeah go. and for Here anyone voice for anyone watching this on Twitch at the moment, I have the benefit of not not recording or anything, so I can let you know Twitchers are doing a bit of a funny at the moment. Oh, is Twitch doing a funny? What do you mean? <laughs> it's 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 going it's gone a bit pear shaped. It's not it's not doing too well at the moment, according to Twitter. Oh oh no. Well, anyways, uh, so there isn't a whole lot of dialogue in this game, as I told Shroom, Liam, and them. Also, chat, please let me know if the game audio is too quiet and I need to turn it up. Right here, it's really quiet because it's just the entry area. But when we get into combat and stuff, let me know if it's uh if it's getting too overpowered by our voices. But uh, I'm going to read through the dialogue for people who actually care about the story. The story in this game is stupid anyways. No one really cares, but there's not much of it, so I'll read it. But hello, you must be new to the Digital Security Guard, otherwise known as the DSG. We are Digi-Elves. Our role is to support the DSG. It's a pleasure working with you. Our other role is to make sure that the developers didn't have to code in too many different Digimon models because they can just copy and paste Digi-Elves over and over again. <laughs> 
We'd love to throw you a welcome party, but an error occurred in this home server system a short while ago. Dang it, that's the whole reason we're here. Right, I'm leaving. <laughs> error 404. <laughs> I'm out. Currently, the systems... Do you guys see the word systems? Is it just me, or does the Y look strange and taller than yeah. the S? Yeah. Y, yeah. y is a bit jazzy. That looks so out of place. The systems are jazzy. under maintenance, so all functions other than the call keeper, save keeper, and bank keeper are down. The gate to the outside world is also closed, so you can't go to the other servers. To tell the truth, we've never experienced anything like this before. I'm a little worried. But we have our DSG. I'm sure everything will be all right. Beeping noises. Message from the DSG. Everything is not all right. We're dying. Everything is fine. So so, so there are various problems in this world, and they turn to us four. Yeah, we're, we're the only... <laughs> that problems are worse than they thought. Yeah, four rookies walk in, three of them with swords and one of them with an axe, and they're like, yeah, they got this. <laughs> <laughs> All members who just logged in report to Commander Ophanimon immediately. Wow, you've been called already? You should find Commander Ophanimon in the Commander Room. Use the gate to the Commander Room to get to there. Good luck. RTK, what was it that you... How did you pronounce Ophanimon in Digimon World Dawn that made no, me want to die? I don't want to talk about it, all right? If you want to know why I, I, I gotta, it, go I gotta, video. <laughs> I gotta find that Dawn video where you pronounced... I don't remember what you said, but it made me want to die. Uh, so we gotta go over here. I've never played this game with four players. It seems like the camera is going to be an absolute mess. Us, uh, whoever is second player has to hit X. I believe us. Uh -huh. That's me. Oh, no. We're stuck here forever. <laughs> <laughs> I told you he was going to hold us hostage. Shroom's smashing X on his keyboard. It's not working. The new Tales of game looks sick. <laughs> yeah, I think oh, RTK called Ophanimon like Ophanimon or something. It made me want to die. Shut up. <laughs> All right, who wants to be this Digi Elf? Who wants to read this dialogue? Uh, sure, I'll do it. Uh, so you're the new DSG members. I need you to. Yeah, you'll be a great help. We're locked inside this server due to a system error. Not many DSG members are left here, so everyone was quite worried. I ad lib. Anyway, you're still new. You have. You may have many questions. Dude, I don't know what this font is, but I want the Y from this font. <laughs> you know that SpongeBob meme where they capitalize it? That's kind of what it is. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you need help, ask the Digi Elves on this floor first. We are not going to talk to a single Digi Elf that the game does not require us to talk to. I'm telling you now. Perfect. But please, please, please talk. talk oh, okay. They're, they're familiar with the systems, though, of this world. They'll surely give you useful inf advice, even. Not information. Probably both. Also, you'll need to learn Digivolve techniques to Digivolve into other Digimon forms. Digivolving in this game is stupid, but I'm pretty sure we'll all get to Digivolve once if I can remember how to do it properly. Okay. Some Digivolve techniques can be acquired by raising your level. And others are given to you as a reward for accomplishing special quests. Alright, so when they say this, leveling up, I think, to level either 15 or 20 will let your rookie change into one of, Digivolve into one of the other rookies. So, like, Doramon will get to Digivolve into Vmon or something. That's the only one that works by levels alone. All of the, like, mega-level Digimon, like, you can get War Greymon X and Metal Garurumon X and stuff like that. To get them, you have to go talk to a Digi-Elf who lets you do a special, like, little dungeon thing that's like a time trial or something. And you have to complete it, like, you have to kill a certain amount of enemies, or you have to do it in a certain amount of time, and then they give you a Digivolution to a Mega level as a result. Let's a random all... Digivolution, or...? No, Let's it's... Really no, it's dependent, me, it, it's dependent on which, <laughs> uh... It's dependent on which Digimon you're playing as. <laughs> okay. So I suggest you take all special quests whenever possible. Oh, I almost forgot. Commander Ophanimon wanted to see you. The commander is in the last room, along the hallway to your upper right. Be sure you behave in front of him, okay? Ophanimon is definitely a woman or genderless. I don't know why don't the Digi-Elf is saying life. him. Digi -elf. <laughs> well then, you better go now. We're counting on you to protect the peace in the digital world. Alright boys, let's go ruin everything. Alright guys, you think that digi -Elf's voice sounded familiar? That was weird. We should all, I'm saying, we should all Digivolve into Doramon. As soon as we get the opportunity, <laughs> everyone be Doramon. That'd be really hard for, because it works in a loop. I don't remember the loop, but that would be like, it would be like Doramon to Giomon to Vimon to Agamon. So like, whoever oh, no. is the furthest one away would have to Digivolve like four times. I'm ready to commit. <laughs> Alright, who wants to be Ophanimon? 
Oh, no, DK, since you know how to yes. pronounce the name so well. Oh, Ponymon? <laughs> okay. Shroom, you're voicing this character. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, which of us is doing Will someone also? please <laughs> read the dialogue? Oh, okay, I've got it. So, you have just joined the DSG. I've been waiting for you. Cool, that's all I need to do. Yes. <laughs> Welcome to the DSG. I'm the commander. What was the name again, OTK? Ofanimon. Oh, Ofanimon. Ofanimon. Oh, <laughs> I know that you probably can't see the character model that well, but Ofanimon is like one of the most women-looking Digimon of all time. Oh, as soon as you, yeah. I mean, I'm just, I'm just going with the general cyborgy thing. All right, that's fine then. I might morph it. <laughs> DSG is a very important section that maintains the safety of all digital worlds. Oh God, I should have. I won't do dialogue. that the entire. <laughs> It's your fault, Chaos. <laughs> Let's fight together to maintain the peace of this world. I'm counting on you. Gilmon goes would... to Agumon to Doramon to Viamon. So that Sorry, would mean... Uh, yeah, Liam, you would have to Digivolve three times to get to Doramon. I'm, I'm ready. <laughs> I would like for you to carry out DSG tasks as soon as possible. But before that, so not as soon as possible, I have a special mission for you. This mission, if you choose to accept it, <laughs> How cliche was that? Oh my yeah. goodness, that's actual dialogue in this game. I, I was looking in chat and I thought Shroom was making a bad joke, but that's the actual dialogue. No. This mission they, they, if you choose to accept it. Yeah. They've made the bad joke for me. This is perfect. That, uh, dude, I hate it. <laughs> chat, by the way, do I need to do I need to turn Shroom up a little bit? He seems to be the quietest of, of, of us four. Just let me know if I need to up him a bit in Discord. But Shroom, <laughs> continue. I'm sure you have already heard that the server is experiencing some difficulties. Actually, a while ago, we lost contact with another server, called the Yamoto server, within the digital world. Immediately thereafter, a mysterious server area called Death Valley appeared. Oh, that sounds lovely. Let's go <laughs> yeah, dude, I want a vacation. <clears throat> awesome. Since then, the malfunction error has spread throughout the server. Chief Leomon and a team of digi elves went to survey the area. But ever since they entered Death Valley, we lost contact with them. Whoever could have predicted that so, sending a team of, of digi elves Valley. led by the most prone to death Digimon of all time would get lost in Death Valley? <laughs> death Valley is such an easy place structural re This place needs a structural overhaul. We highly doubt that they forgot to contact us, and so we suspect foul play. Go to Death Valley. Oh, well, yeah, sure. And find any kind of information regarding their whereabouts. If you find them, I would like for you to rescue them and bring them back. You are our only hope. That's a shame. <laughs> Dude, it's already on. over. It's already <laughs> over. Ofanimon oh, <laughs> definitely a lot stronger than all four of us. Yeah, combined. seriously, Ofanimon oh, so, is a mega level Digimon. We're a bunch of rookies that picked up some scraps of metal and we're like, yeah, we yeah. got this, bro. I don't know about them counting us. Alright, so mad. there are four yeah. areas in this game and they're all fairly long, but pretty much other than whenever we finish an area and therefore have to have story progression with Ofanimon or Serapimon, that was pretty much the longest amount of dialogue in the game. It's so, like, That's let's. Some... this is the exit over here. I'm pretty sure that doing those 360s that you're doing is causing the game to get framey. <laughs> <laughs> I think it actually, well, like, as parkour. you, every time you did a 360 in the air, the game stuttered <laughs> for a second, and I was like, oh no. It's like a Superman uh, logic. You're going too, you're going in a circle too fast and turning back time. Let's, I want to get a look at everyone's weapons before we go. Like, look at how sick, like, the designs in this game are actually pretty awesome. And we Why do get, yeah. we do get some other, <laughs> yeah, we do get some other weapons later on as well. Shroom, you're going to love this. At one point, you get to wield giant dual pistols. Yes. I like. Uh, Alright, guys, RTK's... let's go to Death Valley. What could go wrong? I like RTK's bread knife. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <coughs> Alright, are we actually going to hit something? Yeah, we have to do the tutorial. Oh, ah, yeah. Good. But then we'll get in. But then controls. we're. But after that, they throw you into the game and they barely tell you anything else for the rest of it. I'm, I'm calling Any, it anything now. else I'm you, dying first. Anything else you want in this game, you uh, you pretty much have to go talk to Digi Elves to have them tell you. But that's all optional. 
That's uh, a good I'm gonna question. I'm gonna read through the tutorial stuff. In the overworld, you'll find little map things that are like logs from Leomon. So RTK, you'll get to voice Leomon oh, <laughs> in good. this playthrough. But anyways, uh, before starting your adventure, let's practice the basic Digimon attacks. Why can't I press X? Wait a minute, did I click out of the emulator? Oh no. Okay, good, I just clicked oh. out. Oh, I pressed X! Well, guys, you don't get to know what that was. <laughs> the damage by each weapon attack will vary depending on the weapon unit equipped. Yeah, you can get other weapons in the game. At the Digilab in the main lobby, you can equip weapons that you've obtained by defeating an enemy or have purchased. Press, uh, pressing the X button, which I don't know what that is for all of you. You can jump over small gaps or enemies in this stage. There isn't much parkour in this game, but every time it comes up, it's truly terrible. Okay. <laughs> Guard yourselves from enemy attacks by pressing the B button. Exercise caution because the guarded period is short. By short, they mean it's about two frames out of like 30 or 60 frames. I don't know how many frames this game runs at, but it is near instant. So you have to time it about perfectly. And by that, I mean you probably shouldn't even bother that much trying to guard. When guarding yourself, carefully monitor the enemy's attack in time pressing the B button. Double tap the left stick in the same direction while pressing B to perform a slam attack? I don't even know what that is. The slam attack lets you push away an enemy. It's a useful technique when your Digimon is surrounded. Now let's practice the basic skills I just explained. The thing I skipped over, I'm pretty sure, is that you press X or A to just swing your weapon. Yeah. In the practice stage, your Digimon won't take any damage. You can practice your moves without worrying about losing HP. You can go to the next lesson once you've defeated all the enemies in this stage. Good luck. What is this slam thing they're talking about? Uh, is it like you double tap or you like? No, I don't know how to do it. I, I think you hold. You, do you hold? Oh, no, the hold. That's a different thing. That's the charge attack. They said there was some kind of slam. They said there was some kind of slam by using the guard, but I like can't make it happen. Guys, look, I'm poking them. Yeah, poking them. Poke. Yeah, so I think Doramon and do Doramon and Biamon have like the same attack animation, but uh, Agumon and Giomon have different weapon types. So theirs is different. Uh, who do we think is gonna be the first person to die? Me. Uh, RTK. <laughs> yes. You reckon? Uh, either it's Dude, either I gonna be it's either gonna be RTK. So like when it. I practiced this with RTK, we went to the first area to make sure the game wouldn't lag. And uh, uh -huh. this the game again, this game me. is <laughs> this game is very bad. If an enemy hits you, you take knockback that sends you flying. And if they get you in a corner, they will stun lock you there until you die. <laughs> so okay. I think that'll happen. Either that's gonna happen to RTK, or Shroom is gonna find a ledge that doesn't have an invisible wall, and he's gonna walk off of it. Those are the two. Oh options. no, there are those exist. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Pry, Pry Geel, thank you for the cheer. And I think someone subbed as well. Where was that? And the fall. Oh my goodness, so much stuff is happening. Someone else read this while I find this sub. Oh, there it is. Wait a minute. Zeke of the Falls, thank you for subbing at tier one for two months. Much appreciated. I'm sorry if I missed anyone. Excellent. You've mastered the basic skills. Shroom, do you hear that? that? You're a master. I always was. Of the basic skills. Remember to press each button by carefully monitoring the enemy's moves. Not going to happen. Now I'm going to explain a difficult technique called the spiral attack, or as RTK will call it for us of this playthrough, the Zelda move. Yeah, the Zelda move. Spiral attack can be initiated by circling the left stick in a 360 and pressing A. Spiral attack lets you give damage to all enemies surrounding. It's important to turn the thing carefully by observing the positions and move in directions, yada yada, let's try it. You can go to the next lesson once you've defeated all the enemies. Uh, so yeah. someone, said, someone, said, someone said hold block and then double tap, and I think that might be slam attack. Hold block and double tap. Maybe. Oh, ah. you slide. You do a slide. If you ah. hold B and then slide, you just slide into them. It doesn't seem to do damage, though. Oh, ah, okay. It's just a quick I'm just jump it. skill. Oh, I God. I forgot, I forgot all the buttons ah. then for a second. <laughs> who, who is Agumon? Is that Shroom? You're Agumon? You're like, yeah, I don't really you're, know. You're stuck practically off screen over there. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> I, I keep jumping instead of swinging. By the way, I don't remember how experience works in this game. I'm pretty sure the only person that gets experience is the one who lands the killing blow. I don't think it's shared. <laughs> Wow, that's awful. Pressing the right button, I think X is just jump. I might be I wrong. It like, might be yeah. shared, but I do not remember. Excellent. You've mastered the spiral attack. Now let's practice MP techniques. So really quickly, I'm pretty sure that they're not going to tell us this, but I'm going to let you guys know. MP techniques are really good, obviously. They're like the strongest damage dealer, so we want to use them. Also, you don't want to... More often than not, you don't want to try and save your MP because the way you level up to stronger magic moves is to use the one you have right now like 40,000 times. It takes oh, a cool. lot of usages to get it to level up. I played this game before and I got to the end and I think I only leveled it up once. <laughs> but, so hmm. you know, it's again, this game is pretty bad. This game is also designed for you to NG plus it like three times. So <laughs> that's probably part of the reason, but we're, we're more than likely only going to play it once. Uh, to use MP techniques, you press R to open the MP window. Use that to select the MP you want to use. Press A to execute it, so the attack button. 
You can master new MP techniques or increase your technique levels by improving the applicable skills. That just means to use it repeatedly. Each time you use the MP technique, you're given a chance to improvise the applicable skill. The skill improves by one point at a time, and that's an, I'm pretty sure that's an invisible uh, statistic. If your Digimon does not have enough MP required by the selected technique, you can't use that move. Let's practice using MP techniques against actual enemies. Yada, yada, yada. I think this is... There's only one more training thing after this. Hey, look, RTK, it's your favorite. How to use the... How to use it again? Press, press the right stick and then just press X when you're selecting. It's just like Kingdom Hearts when you're selecting magic. Petty shock. Petty yeah. fire. Yeah, I think Agumon and... Agumon and Geomon both have petty fire. I have petty ice. And then, uh... Vimon has petty bolt. <laughs> Apparently, you get 100% of the experience for a killing blow, and an assist gives you 50%. Any assist gets ah. an additional 50. That's so unnecessarily convoluted. Yes. Excellent. You've mastered using MP techniques. Now, let's practice the charge attack. This is what you found earlier. I'm just going to skip through this because it's super basic. You just hold the A button, and when it turns yellow, you let go. Yeah. And it's, it's the same charge move no matter what. Yeah. Spin. All right, Link? Thank, is that Link? you? Yeah, thanks, Link. <laughs> <laughs> Spiral move, yeah. go! Vimon looks like he's holding like the mask. and the double tap. I'm trying to slide. I do plus, love plus that whenever we accomplish something, we all <laughs> coordinate a fist pump. Do we? We'd oh, never get it off him. We'd never do that in real life. No, no way. Excellent, you've mastered the charge attack. Now you've come to the final lesson. Defeat all the enemies in the stage using the moves you've learned. You'll have more fun playing the game once you've learned to combine these attacks. Also pay attention to the gimmicks in the stage. The gimmicks in this game are awful, such as opening doors and uh, appearing bridges that will emerge once all enemies are defeated. Good luck. Don't tell me I'm going to enjoy this I'm game. Like, a Kakatorimon? Does this only... Does this always spawn in the, uh... Ow. Push him off the ledge. Does this thing always... Zap. Does that thing always uh, spawn behind in the train, me. Or is it only oh. when you're doing multiplayer? 